All right, guys, so I wanted to show you what's inside Mexican jumping beans. Now, these I bought a while ago, a few months ago, and I completely forgot about them. I looked in here, and I noticed, oh, everything hatched. Now, it's kind of sad because they weren't able to get out, so they did die in here. But now we can take a look and see what comes inside of these beans. So what we have here, it looks like they come out in cocoons here. As you can see this one right here. Kind of looks like a little cocoon comes out first, like a little larvae. You can see a couple of them kind of look like uh, the shell of a, let's say like a cichlid or something before it hatches into a flying insect. And then once it hatches, it turns into this flying insect. We have one inside the cup here. And as you can see, it's like a little moth. So inside of these Mexican jumping beans, you can see right here on the side how they get out. And that's how they get out of the bean. You can see that in a couple of them how they got out of there and um, that's what's inside Mexican jumping beans that's what makes them move it's these little larvae that uh, eat their way out eventually and then turn into these moths so just wanted to show that show you guys what comes out of jumping beans so uh, have any questions let me know happy pet keeping see you all later